me to move, let me know. Oh, you're good, bud. Can I ask a few questions? Uh, look at me when you answer. Uh huh. Okay, so just give me a little bit of a rundown of what happened. Oh, well, I was grinding on a piece of uh, metal over here, uh, to keep the noise out the back driveway, and I, I guess he kicked up a couple sparks. And uh, I looked up, and there's a fire that started. So I went over here and grabbed a hose, trying to wet it down. The hose wasn't long enough, so I jumped over the fence and started basically trying to contain it, make a little perimeter and stuff. And uh, it kind of got out of control, so I came over here while I was using a little pump sprayer. And then, uh, yeah, I just went to go get a hose, and that's when the fire department showed up. Okay, so you didn't call the fire department? Nah, I was working with both hands, man. You know, just either sit on the phone and call somebody for help, or, you know, kind of make it happen for yourself, you know? And how long was it from when the fire started to when the fire department arrived? You think? Like in any fight, man, it seems like it's forever, but it was probably only a few minutes, you know? Yeah, and what were you, what were you thinking when fire was getting a little bit out of control or you gave the cars gotta yeah. connect it yeah with the field to your back here, here. and stuff it's kind of like you know do you go for the do you go for the open you go for the stuff that's going about to hit an open burn or do you go for the stuff that's about you know property yep. so i went for the property first and then uh, yeah well great job trying to you know get it under control and i think you did a lot i think you could have got a lot worse if you didn't help out oh yeah I, yeah i'm not one to run from a fight man all right well great job buddy all right you're good, you're good.